Currently at the Design Museum is an exhibition by A. Weiwei called Making Sense. The museum is situated on the edge of Holland Park on South Kensington High Street. As you approach the entrance there are a pair of marble sofas, a replica of the ones his father owned. Further on and opposite the entrance is pendant, a large marble toilet roll. As you enter the building you are faced with coloured house. This once belonged to a wealthy family and A. Weiwei has taken the timber frame and painted it in industrial colours. It is also installed on crystal bases. Around the walls is his wallpaper. The animal looks like a llama but really is an alpaca. The exhibition itself is on the ground floor and is split into areas such as the floor, walls and objects in cases. We will start our tour from the left hand end looking at the fields first and then the wall art and then finally the objects around the room. Starting on the left is a field of Lego with a few other items mixed in. Next along is left right studio material. These are the remains of sculptures broken when his studio was demolished in 2018 by the Chinese state. Next to it is one of these sculptures called Bubble and it is the largest porcelain sphere that can be made without breaking in the kiln. This field is made up from porcelain cannonballs of various sizes. These are from the Song Dynasty. This field has over a quarter of a million porcelain teapot spouts, again from the Song Dynasty. The final field by the far wall is called Still Life and is made up of stone tools from the late Stone Age. Standing over the Lego field is a wooden structure called Through. It is made from columns of a temple and it has tables on it as well. Through this we can get a glimpse of the water lilies. Water lilies is a recreation of Monet's famous painting but in Lego. It is the largest Lego picture he has done to date. He deliberately placed it behind other displays so you have to go and view it close up. On the back wall are two sculptures, Backpack Snake and Life Vest Snake. These are dedicated to the refugee crisis in Europe and the 2008 Sichuan earthquake. On the right hand wall are 12 prints entitled Study of Perspective, showing a disrespect for world institutions. There are a number of other items on display, which include everyday objects made from unusual materials. These are jade seals and he used them to print the names of the 5,197 school children who died in the 2008 Sershkwan earthquake. The final piece is a Hung Dynasty urn with the Coca-Cola logo on it. The exhibition is on until the 30th of July and it is well worth a visit. If you enjoyed this, why not watch the previous episodes? And don't forget to subscribe as new content is put up weekly.